religion, religious, religion. Religion is the root of all evil. Or so would say an atheist, usually. So today we're going to be looking at religion bashing, blaming religion, saying religion is to blame, saying that religion is the worst thing ever and religion should be eliminated, that the world would be a better place without religion. So and I'm going to show the ridiculousness of that statement. If you go to someone who says they have no religion, and they usually call themselves an atheist, you ask them, do you have a religion? And they say, no, I don't. I'm an atheist. And then I say, oh, really? You don't have religion. There's no one that you worship. There's no one that you pray to in times of great need and stress. I mean, what about your thoughts? What do you think? What about your so-called loved ones? Don't you worship them? And of course, yeah, then you consider, well, it's not a fictitious person. Well, then I could say, so you don't worship celebrities, actors, fictional characters in movies, books, stories, you don't have conversations or relationship to people in your heads, imaginary people playing conversations out. So is this not the same as talking to God in your head or angels or what have you, your guide? How is that much different? I mean, let's look at another point, how we blame religion as being so hypocritical as to not support people more. Like you see the Pope with a lot of gold and wealth. I mean, in all honesty, are you using your money, your gold, to support others, assuming you have it? And if you would have it, would you? Would you say, if I had a million dollars, I would support what's best for everyone? So, I mean, I don't really see much of a religion problem what I see is a human problem problem is in the human not in the religion and now to finish this little investigation let us look at what religion would be if you were to consider everyone, do what's best for everyone. What would it be like to have a human being who's walked the path of perfection? What would their religion be? The word religion is very similar in meaning to the word philosophy. Same as principles, 
your code, your code of honor, what you do, what you do not do, how you live, what you will do, what you will stand by. I mean, that's what religions are, isn't it? You teach how to act, how to be, and why you do what you do. So a person who does what's best for everyone, they would do it because it simply is what is best for everyone. Their reason is the very action that they live, who they are, so completely. To be a person of action, of doing, of daily living, and applying of strength, of challenge, of so practicality, so useful, so relevant to daily life, that would be having a real impact on their day-to-day -day living. I mean, that would be nice if that was a religion, I suppose. But of course, religion nowadays, just like the human being, the words of a human being has no weight, carries no weight, carries no promise. You can't trust the word of a human being. They will say one thing, they will do another. That really is the problem with religion. It's the, human, it's the human being. Can't keep their own word. And live what they say they will live. I mean, it's pretty obvious, isn't it? So many principles within the various religions that could be applied. And they're very much aligned with what's best. For everyone but they aren't and that is on the human so religion doesn't say much your word what you do what you stand by keeping your promises standing by what you commit yourself to do that would be the best religion possible that kind of honesty that kind of self person that would be too bad now would it if that were everyone's religion stick to what you say follow through world would change overnight, wouldn't it? It's such a simple thing. And the question comes down to why can't the human being even understand what is going on within them? What is it that is somehow Preventing us from doing what we will say we would do in the moment. But is it that question is what we answer for ourselves here at Destiny? Join us. Ask the questions and you will get
the answer.